This is SAT test 8, calculator question number 12. College Board gives us a description of an insurance agent's sales and goals in terms of $50,000 insurance policies and $100,000 insurance policies. They say his goal was to sell at least 57 policies. And he did not meet his goal. And they also say the total value of the policies he sold was over $3 million, which the following system of inequalities describes X, the $50,000 policies, and Y, the number of $100,000 policies that Roberto sold. So not his goal, but what he actually sold last month. Since he did not meet his goal of 57 policies, X plus Y, where X is the number of 50,000 and Y is the number of $100,000 policies, X plus Y has to be less than 57. So this equation is good, and this equation is good. X plus Y greater than 57 was his goal, but that's not what he actually sold, so choices B and D are wrong. What we're trying to do is find the system that matches, and almost always for this question, you'll want to cross out wrong answers until only one choice is left. Now they do say the total value of policies he sold was over three million. In this case, total value is under three million, because 50,000 times the number of 50,000 policies plus $100,000 times the number of $100,000 policies is the total sales, and this says that was less than three million. This says the same quantity is greater than three million, so both inequalities in choice C match the description of the problem. It's well worth your time to reread the problem to make sure you're answering the question they're asking because the whole point of this question is to make sure you get the direction of the inequalities right. And it, there's a distractor that his goal was 57, but they later say he did not meet his goal and we want a system for what he actually sold. So choice C would be the correct answer here. College Board typically asks six questions on systems of equations, so it's worth taking the time to get good at these questions. Come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.